Benvenuti a questa lezione. Welcome to this new lesson of the Cornelliano Valdo Biadini Academy, in which we should be able to understand why the distinctiveness of Cornelliano Valdo Biadini DOCG has its roots in a unique area, the one where Prosecco originated. To appreciate the superior nature of this denomination, we will discover the uniqueness in terms of climate and soil characteristics of the hills of Cornelliano Valdo Biadini. We will learn why in this area we are safeguarding the vitality and health of our old vines. We will find out about this area's commitment to viticulture that conserves the environment and keeps nature alive over the course of time. Today's teachers are Diego Tomasi, researcher at Conegliano Center for Viticultural Research. Diego Ivan, biologist at the University of Padua. Filippo Taglietti, the consortium's technical director. We have seen in the previous lesson that the prime factor that makes Conegliano Valdobbiadene superior is nature. Here, the variety of the soils is in fact combined with an ideal microclimate. When we talk about Conegliano Valdobbiadene Prosecco wine, we mustn't forget that this wine is made from a specific and particular grape variety, which is called Glera. Glera is an indigenous variety which originated, was discovered and spread in these hills. In the case of the Glera variety, which buds very early in the spring following its period of repose during the winter, it is important that temperatures should be mild. This is guaranteed by the presence behind the area's hills of the barrier of the pre-Alps, which protects these hills from the cold winds that blow down from the north. Thanks to the fact that vine growers are above all weather forecasters, the vineyards are almost all south or east facing, with exposures that are most favorable for benefiting from the sun's rays, and thus maximizing the thermal effects of these hills. A second factor is the summer rainfall, which is higher compared to the plain for the simple reason that we are up in the hills. Then there is the difference of 12 to 14 degrees centigrade between day and nighttime temperatures in the second half of August and in September. Crucial for the synthesis of the aromatic compounds that are so important in Conegliano Valdobbiadene Prosecco, which indeed results from this temperature shock to which the vines are subjected. These climatic conditions, therefore, allow the variety to express itself at its best, and they exist only in this particular area. Around 65 million years ago, these hills weren't yet here. There was just sea, and then, thanks to tectonic forces, over the course of millions of years, these hills rose and were shaped by the elements. Here we are in the central part of the Conegliano Valdobbiadene zone, a conglomeration of calcareous origin that is ideal for producing wines that are complex on the nose and mineral in flavor. At this moment, we are in the Filetti district. This area is famous for its red soils, perfect for making fruity, well-balanced wines. Now we are in Cartizze. This is marl, a sedimentary rock ideal for producing floral, tangy wines. Let's now talk about the vineyards. There are vineyards that, in some cases, are 80 or 100 years old. Vineyards that contain extremely rich biodiversity, because these vines are historic vines that are nearly all different from each other. About 15 years ago, the consortium realized the value of these plants and started mapping them and cataloging them. In order to preserve the genetic biodiversity of these fantastic vineyards, we collect some tiny parts of these hundred-year-old vines, from which we obtain young cuttings. 
Here we are in a recently planted vineyard, derived from the old mother vines. These young plants represent the new parent vines through which the old genetic material will continue to exist over time. The abundant diversity of vegetation and flora in these vineyards reflects the care that goes into tending them and the quality of the environment. The countryside itself is also a part of wine, and scenic beauty is always associated with goodness. The vine grower is not only a meteorologist, but also a landscape painter. These embellishments that he has succeeded in creating in these hills, the various layouts of the vine rows, the various forms of the vineyards, have created a landscape that is undoubtedly unique and absolutely inimitable. In this region, new generations are emerging who have been able to understand the importance of vine growing and the future it can provide. They have created a viticultural protocol that includes a whole series of principles and courses of action aimed at protecting and enhancing the quality of the zone. I have chosen, like many others in the Conegliano Valdobbiarene DOCG, to use only environmentally friendly products, so as to safeguard consumers' health and protect our wines and our terroir. In cultivating vines, man alters the balance of nature, and it is only right that he should do so using the right techniques. That means knowing the ecosystem in which he operates and getting as close as possible to the rhythms and laws of nature. Using waste products from production, such as grape pomace and the residues of winter pruning, we obtain compost that we add to the land we have cultivated. Besides, this compost is pretty fertile, so it increases the vitality of the soil. A lively soil is also a healthy soil. Man operates within this environment and plays a leading role in it. A healthy rapport between man and the environment will allow the area to pass on the same nature, culture and traditions as before to future generations as well. lesson we have learned about the unique nature in terms of climate and soil characteristics at the hills of Conegliano Valdobbiadene. We have understood why in this region we are safeguarding the vitality and health of our old vines. And we have found out about the zone's commitment to viticulture that conserves the environment and keeps nature alive in the long term. All that remains is for you to visit the hills of Conegliano Valdobbiadene to experience, see, smell and of course taste the difference.